Operating the dyno, this is what the operator is looking at. We have our air fuel ratios here, uh, engine speed, and then we have uh, SVP, which is standard temperature and pressure, horsepower, and torque. This dyno reads several different types of horsepower, but this is the main one we go off of. For this particular vehicle, we changed the uh, supercharger sound, did a smaller pulley for the supercharger, smaller underdrive pulley, added an aftermarket intake, long tube headers, and exhaust. And after performing a custom dyno tune, we were able to achieve uh, 610 horsepower at the, wheels, at the wheels out of it. sure it doesn't go too rich which means there's too much air fuel or too much fuel in the mixture or too lean which means there's not enough fuel which both could be uh, damaging to the engine. You need to know the computer systems in order to program them so yes everything is on the car is computer programmed and the old school days you could just turn your distributor a little bit change a couple of jets and you're good now you've got to change five to ten tables just to get the fuel to change or the timing to change, things like that, so it's all integrated now.